Hey guys, it is Kayla Waller with Waller Adventures. We asked our viewers to submit us questions that you had pertaining to our YouTube channel. So today we are going to do the Waller Adventures Q&A. <laughs> All right, so we had a lot of questions come in, but we are going to only do the top three most asked questions and the top three most unique questions. So let's get started. So our first most asked question is, what was your favorite video to film? I actually have three videos that were my favorite to film. The first one is the fishing with a kid's Star Wars fishing pole video and the reason is because I actually filmed that on my 30th birthday. Um, I was going to go by myself and just go fishing in that morning but Jerry tagged along with me and we brought the camera and everything and um, so we turned it into kind of a tag along with the magnet fishing video where I found that Star Wars fishing pole and um, so we just went back and used it and created it into like a whole new fishing video with the Star Wars fishing pole included. It was an awesome uh, uh, father-daughter moment uh, of us fishing and the landscape was just so beautiful. You could see the fog coming off of the, um, the pond. The other video is the firearms training video which was actually filmed later on that afternoon on my birthday. The reason why that's my favorite is because I've always wanted to video shooting a, a gun and then going back and slowing it down to see the smoke come out of the gun and the sound and, and the bullet just shooting out. Because you see it in the movies all the time where, you know, they'll, you know, shoot and then they just slow it down. And um, I thought it was cool that I could actually make it slow down and I could actually see it with me and my dad and my mom shooting it. And the other video is the trail riding adventure video and um, I've ridden horses for 25 years and I've always wanted to film a my personal point of view riding a horse because um, I have family and friends that are not equestrians um, and every time I try to explain to them on how I am in that moment or what I have to do in that moment they can never you know grasp it so I've always said I wish I can just put you know a camera up to me or on my helmet so that way you can see and hear what I have to do in order to make that horse jump or what I have to do to make you know that horse do this or you know so it was like a dream come true for me to do that so the second most asked question is which video was the worst for you to film for me it was the how to build the water adventures garden part one and two the reason being is because i had to dub myself over <laughs> pictures or well, a slideshow basically so the third most asked question which is kind of a unique one well not really unique but it's kind of a it kind of it kind of confused me which is are you going to be making more cooking videos? Yes, we are going to be doing more cooking videos this year. We are going to be doing new healthy recipes and we are also going to be doing uh, old family recipes from Grandma Lois. And uh, Grandma Lois's uh, biscuit making video was actually the number one video on my channel for like two weeks, which is crazy because it's just a simple biscuit making recipe, but I guess everyone wants to know how to make biscuits from scratch apparently. But um. At the end of this month, I'm going to announce this, so I'm not going to fully announce it or I'm not going to fully go into full detail about it, but we are going to be doing a year-long segment on a town in North Carolina where we're going to go and uh, do all the festivals, go to the bar and pubs, to the museums, to historic sites. We're going to uh, investigate some ghost tours and ghost stories in the area. Um, we are also going to be uh, doing some magnet fishing there, uh, some fishing there. So we're all we're trying to put all of our playlists involved in it. But we are going to be doing restaurant reviews here as well. But if you are curious into knowing what town we're going to, I will put a video up at the top. 
and if you watch that video and listen carefully on our location you will know what town we're going to. So here are the three most unique questions asked. Number one is how did you come up with the Waller Adventures name? <laughs> I'm surprised this one got asked because my last name is Waller and uh, I, just add, I just added adventures to it but that is not the case. So I went on Ancestry.com to find out where my family came from, where the Waller side came from, where the Herring side came from. The Herring side is my family's, is, is my mom's side of the family. Um, I found on the Waller side, my great great grandfather came from England and landed in Maryland and uh, set up shop there. He had some, he purchased a whole bunch of land and back then it was um, considered that you, I mean, it was a thing to where if you had enough land to house a hundred people, you could name it whatever you wanted to and it would be an official uh, land. I, I, don't know how, I don't know how to describe it. They had that much land and my grandfather, great, 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 great grandfather named it Waller's Adventure. So I kind of took that and ran with it and switched S around to Waller Adventures. So the second most unique question asked is, what drove you to get into the outdoors and make it a personal passion of yours? That, <laughs> that is a really, really good question. Um, I guess it started when um, I was growing up and when my grandparents lived in LaGrange on their farm, I would go outside and, you know, play in the garden, you know, in the dirt. Uh, and then as I got older, I would go hunting with my uncle and go to, um, you know, camp and go fishing and play in the dirt, ride four-wheelers out there. And, um, and also, I guess, my love for animals and especially me being an equestrian, um, that helped being out, you know, my love for outdoors. So the third most unique question, which is the hardest question I have ever heard, is fishing or hunting? That is a tough one because I do both and I love both. But I think I like fishing a smidge better. And here is the reason why. I love hunting, um, I love the, this is going to sound horrible, but I love the thrill and the adrenaline rush when you see that big buck or that, you know, nice doe walk out and you take a couple minutes to sit there and decide if you're going to shoot it or not. And then when you decide to shoot it and you line up your gun to shoot and that adrenaline just starts pumping and the fact that you're taking a living thing's life but you're but you're doing it to feed your family to give them life I don't it's, it's kind of it's, it's it's just the adrenaline rush of that and I am very proud I guess it, I, it boosts up my pride when I can say I went out and killed something and brought the meat back to feed my family I do respect nature and I do respect the animals um, that I do kill. Um, I just don't go out every day and hunt and shoot, you know, whatever walks out. I actually take the time to make sure what I'm killing is what I, you know, is worth it. The thing that I hate about hunting is I hate the cold. I hate being out in the cold. I hate shivering. I hate everything about being cold. Um, luckily this hunting season it was, it was warm, but I hate being cold. But that's the only negative thing I have about it. But fishing, I've actually, I've done more fishing than hunting. Um, I go fishing with my grandpa, Grandpa Bobby all the time. And he's the one that taught me everything with fishing. Um, I actually don't use fake lures. I use live bait. I, use, I either use worms or crickets or when I'm out. Um, 
at the beach fishing I'll use some shrimp or squid but um I don't really have any negative things about fishing I don't I don't go fishing when it's cold I like I, I don't I don't like the cold I rather really go fishing in the summer um I don't really have anything negative the only negative thing I, I, about fishing is um when I'm out at the ocean and I get those, those sea robins ugh, they creep me out with the legs oh god they creep me out um I think I think that's about it for the fish for you know the negatives about fishing all right guys thanks for watching the Waller Adventures Q&A video um we hopefully will be doing this again next year uh so y'all can uh you know be on the lookout for this next January but uh keep subscribing keep sharing the channel keep sharing everything uh all the videos the youtube the youtube channel the facebook page the instagram page keep sharing it sharing it to your friends and family um and next saturday we'll be dropping another video of the top video of the year so thanks for watching see you soon did you enjoy that waller adventures video then check us out on our youtube channel at waller adventures like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon to get notified on when we post more videos. Also check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you soon.